Inventors, Professor Prototype here to help you create your pitch video for the National Invention Convention and Entrepreneurship Expo, also known as NICE. You are already an awesome inventor and have been selected to represent your state program at NICE. Congratulations! You will soon fill out your online registration. Information from your online application and your maximum four minute pitch video will be part of the judging process. The following criteria will be used in judging. You will be evaluated on how you went through the invention process, from identifying and understanding, ideating, designing and building, testing and refining your prototype. You will also be evaluated on your invention's impact, its market potential, value proposition, social value and its originality. And finally, inventor communication, which includes your logbook, display board, prototype or model, and your live pitch question and answer, as well as the pitch video. So, let's talk about your pitch video. What should be in your pitch video, and why is it important? Let me share some tips. A pitch video is the way you share your invention and how it came to be with the world. You will create a video using a smartphone, tablet, or camera with video capabilities. Your video cannot be produced in any way. This means don't use fancy editing programs or add text, animations, overlays, or photo editing graphics in your video. Like I just used here, don't do it. Your video must be a continuous video with no starts, stops, or fade in and out transitions. Yep, that was a fade in and out transition. Don't do it. You want every student inventor to have the same opportunity in the pitch video, and not all students have the technology or programs for editing. This video is about content, not video production. So, how do you get started? Find a quiet, well-lit place. Natural light is okay and works really well. Remember to not have window light behind you or bright lights. You don't want to be in shadow and backlit. You want the light coming towards you, your prototype, and the board. What does this mean? Well, if you have windows in the room, set up your project on the other side of the room, preferably in front of a wall or another area where you can stand and present. The window light from the opposite side of the room will brighten you and your presentation. Make sure you have your prototype or model so you can talk about it, show how it works, and use it in your video. Your board will be helpful too. You will use it to help you as you explain your invention process, data collected, and the journey to your prototype. You will begin your video by introducing yourself and what you invented. If you are on a team, each inventor must introduce themselves. Teams should all be sharing information in the video, so decide who's going to talk about what before you start. Remember to speak in a loud, clear voice. You are the expert on your invention. We all get nervous sometimes. Fight being nervous. Talk as if you were explaining everything to your best friend. It's a camera and you can start over. You can also ask someone to ask you questions if it makes you feel more comfortable. You are telling a story, so it's best to start at the beginning. You started with a problem, so begin with how you found the problem you solved. What is the problem you solved? Why did you feel this problem was important and needed a solution? How did you discover the problem? Did you have this problem? Does someone you know have the problem? Or did you learn about the problem in another way? Tell us about it. We want to know. Tell the viewer what you learned about the problem and who was affected by this problem. Talk about what items might already be on the market to solve this problem and how your solution is unique and different. Let people know about the research you did on who would use your product and how they would benefit from it. If you talked with people about the problem or did surveys before you began thinking about ways to solve your problem, tell us what you learned. The more you can share about your problem and how you brainstormed and researched to solve it, the better. After you have shared your problem and the research you did to understand it, it's time to talk about how you designed and built your solution. We know prototypes don't always work the first time. You probably went through a few versions before you arrived at your final prototype. Talk about what solutions didn't work, why they didn't work, and what you learned to make the next version. Talk about materials and how you built it. 
When you are talking about your prototype, make sure to hold it up and bring in the camera a little closer and show it. As you explain your solution prototype, use the actual prototype and point out what you are talking about. Show the viewer its features and how it works or would work. You can point out where it is better than earlier versions because of improvements you made. Talk about challenges you had and anything new you had to learn or do to make your prototype. You were determined and figured things out. Tell us about it. Talk about how you tested your invention. Did you have people use it? Did you collect feedback? Share what you learned from testing and how it helped you redesign or improve your prototype. If you have thought about where you would get bulk materials to build your product, what it would cost to produce, where you would sell it and how you would market it, share this information too. If you have a provisional patent or are represented by an attorney or patent agent, you should mention this as well. Remember to keep your video at four minutes or under and have fun making it. You have worked hard on your invention and now you get to tell everyone about how you did it. After your video is finished, you will need to upload it to YouTube. You can create a channel just for this or post on a family member's channel. Do not mark your video as private or judges will not be able to access it. You can make it unlisted. When you are ready to fill out your online registration, you will copy and paste your YouTube video link to your application registration in the appropriate field. Your pitch video is important and should be something you plan and take your time to create. We want you to have fun with it and enjoy sharing your invention story and your prototype with us. Invent on, superstar. We'll see you at NICE.